Today we'll recap a 2009 American horror film named The House of the Devil. A financially struggling college student Samantha Hughes takes a strange babysitting job that coincides with a full lunar eclipse. She slowly realizes her clients harbor a terrifying secret, putting her life in mortal danger. Kindly remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you like the video. The movie starts in the 1980s when we see a college student named Samantha. Samantha was looking for a house to rent for herself and she likes a house. The landlady there is also very cooperative and tells her that she is just like her daughter, so she will not have to pay any deposit, and by giving her one month's advance she can shift there. Now Samantha says thanks to her and she becomes very happy to get such a good deed. I'll after which she comes to her hostel, but her roommate had put a do not disturb sign on the door so that no one would come inside. Now Samantha comes back out of the hostel and she was desperate to pay her rent when sees an ad for a babysitting job. She calls the number given in that ad but no one picks up the call. So she leaves a message on it and tells the number of her room. Then she starts leaving from there but then the phone starts ringing. In it, a man confirms her name to her and says that he wants to meet her outside the student affairs office. Now Samantha goes back to her room where her roommate was sleeping with her boyfriend and the room stuff was also completely scattered. She takes her bag from the room and starts waiting for the man outside the office. But even after waiting for a long time, no one comes there. So she comes back from there. She then meets her best friend Megan and tells her that she needs money, on which Megan offers to get her money from her dad. But Samantha denies it and tells her about the babysitter job. Now Megan says that she should remove all the ads installed on the campus so that the man does not get any babysitter and she will get the job. But Samantha does not even agree to do so and comes back to her hostel. There her roommate tells her that there was a call for her. Then Samantha calls back on that number but no one picks up the call. Now Samantha is recording messages when suddenly a man says that he had talked to a girl for a babysitting job in the morning. But now she refuses to join and is not getting any other babysitter. He tells that he needs a babysitter urgently. Now because Samantha also needed money, she gets ready for the job. Now Samantha leaves to go there with Megan and that night the lunar eclipse was about to happen. Megan tells Samantha that she will stay with her but Samantha tells her not to worry about her. Then she tells her that seeing her upset, she took out all the ads on the campus. Megan tells her that she doesn't find this family normal. Now crossing a graveyard, they finally reach the given address, which was a very big mansion. Here they also see a car standing outside the mansion. Now a man named Omen greets them at the door and takes them inside. Omen tells them that they have recently shifted to this town and did not get time to go out anywhere. He tells that now because of them, they will be able to see the lunar eclipse which will be very clear from this area. Then he takes Samantha to another room to talk where Samantha tells him that Megan will not stay there. Omen reveals that he does not have any children but he and his wife have a grown son. The job is to attend to his wife's mother, to whom he refers to as Abel Body. Samantha box at first but then agrees to a fee of $400. Now Megan asks her not to do this job because she found Omen very strange, and she also found it strange that why is he paying so much money for a small job. But Samantha was in need of money so she tries to convince her. But Megan leaves angrily and reluctantly agrees to pick up her at 12.30am. Now on the way back, Megan stops to smoke near the graveyard but she did not have a lighter. Then suddenly a man comes there, due to which she gets very scared, he asks her if she is the new babysitter, and as she says no, he shoots her on the head. On the other hand, Omen gives an advance to Samantha and also gives some extra money for ordering pizza. He says that his mother does her own work and all she has to do is take care of the house. He gives her a number and tells her to call if there is an emergency. He also gives her the number for ordering pizza. Now after some time, Samantha listens to Omen talking to someone where he says that the babysitter has arrived and now everything will be fine. And then Ullman's wife comes there from the basement and tells her name is Vivin. She says that she went downstairs to get her coat, which Samantha finds strange because Ullman was talking to someone upstairs and she thought he was talking to her wife. Now while leaving, Mrs. Ullman tells Samantha not to disturb the mother because she likes to be alone. And Ullman again reminds her to order pizza. Now after they leave, Samantha tries to call Megan but her phone is switched off, so she leaves her a message saying to call her back when she reaches home. Then she orders pizza and while waiting for it to arrive, she starts roaming around the house to pass the time. After this, she turns on the TV, in which the discussion of the lunar eclipse is going on. 
So she turns off the TV and listens to the songs in her Walkman and starts dancing around the house. While dancing, she collides with a vase due to which it breaks. Now as she is picking up its pieces, she sees a door which is of a cupboard. She sees a lot of coats in it and wonders why Miss S. Ullman went to the basement to get the coat. Here she also gets some photos in which she sees a family which was not of Ullman, but the car was the same that she saw outside the mansion. Now Samantha comes out to check, but she sees a van parked there and a man standing behind it. She comes in and calls Megan again, but she gets worried as Megan doesn't pick up the phone. Then she goes to the washroom to cool herself down when she hears someone walking in the house. Now Samantha takes a knife and goes upstairs to check, where in a room she finds the dead bodies of the family who were in the photo and a pentagram was also made on the floor. Then she hears some sounds from the attic and when she starts going upstairs to check, suddenly the doorbell rings which frightens her badly. There is a pizza delivery boy at the door. She quickly grabs the pizza and closes the door. Now here we see that the pizza delivery guy is the one who shot and killed Megan, and he didn't even leave after giving the pizza. Then Samantha calls the emergency number given by Omen, but the operator tells that this number is not correct. Now she does not understand anything and then the phone rings and it was from the emergency service. They ask her if she has an emergency, but she does not tell anything and says that she had called by mistake. After this, she starts eating pizza while watching TV, but finds the taste of the pizza somewhat strange, which she then throws in the trash bin. Then she hears a strange sound, which she comes up again to check. She sees that there is a lot of hair in the bathtub which she is shocked to see. Then she again hears a voice from the attic and then she starts going upstairs to check it. Now as soon as she turns on the light, the lights of the entire house trip due to which the whole house becomes dark. Now more voices start coming from inside and someone starts coming out of the attic, due to which Samantha gets scared badly. Then suddenly her health starts deteriorating and she comes down from there with great difficulty and falls unconscious in the hallway. Now the lunar eclipse had started and when Samantha regains consciousness, she is lying on top of the pentagon drawn in that room and her hands and feet were tied. She was very scared and starts trying to free herself. Just then, Mr. and Mrs. Ullman enter the room wearing strange gowns, and along with them that man also comes there who is their son Victor. Now Ullman's mother is revealed to be a grotesque witch-like figure, who goes near Samantha and starts performing a ritual. She slices her arm and pours her blood into a goat skull, using the blood to draw occult symbols on Samantha's stomach. She then puts that skull on her stomach and then draws a sign on her forehead and tries to make her drink that blood. But Samantha resists and rescues herself by hitting him. She starts running away after attacking all of them and after coming up. She collides with Megan's dead body. Then she picks up a knife from the kitchen and only then does Victor comes there and shoots her in the shoulder. But Samantha suddenly attacks him with a knife and kills him. Then she hears someone coming and hides in the attic's washroom. Here Miss S. Ullman sees Victor's dead body and goes after Samantha to the attic. Here Samantha was very scared and she was seeing the scary face of that woman again and again. Then she sees that strange marks have formed on her stomach. Then Miss S. Ullman starts taking her out of there and says that she cannot stop it now. Next, she starts talking to the moon by standing near the window. And then Samantha attacks her from behind and kills her. Then Samantha picks up Victor's gun and starts calling the emergency service but that scary face was constantly haunting her, after which she comes out of the house. Now Ullman starts following her, but Samantha somehow manages to reach Megan's car. Then Ullman also comes there after her and says that he has chosen her, so she should talk to him. He says that it is her destiny to accept him, but Samantha threatens to shoot him, to which he says that she can shoot him because he is just a messenger. And now it is too late. Then Samantha shoots herself. The scene cuts to a TV news broadcast about the strange lunar eclipse the night before, which confounded scientists due to its abrupt ending. Then we see an unconscious Samantha in the hospital, where a nurse pats her on the stomach and says that they will both get well soon. And the movie ends here. Thanks for watching.